Hi everyone, Miss Tui here. Time for your skills check. You will combine what you have learned so far about color codes to help Ozobot demonstrate a sequence of events and move through a maze. For today's lesson, you'll need an Ozobot, fully charged and calibrated, color code markers, and your Introduction to Color Codes Lesson 5 Skills Check Activity Sheet. In today's lesson, you will read sentences to determine the directions your bot should travel through a maze and the actions your bot should demonstrate. Draw color codes to program your bot to move in a specific direction and draw color codes to program your bot to move at a set speed or perform a special move. You will need both activity sheets in front of you. The first activity sheet tells about Ozobot's events. The second activity sheet is the maze Ozobot needs to move through, showing the events in the correct order. You will read one event at a time. Then you will use the color codes key to determine the missing color codes that go with that event. Let's get started. Look at activity sheet one. The first event says Ozobot was hungry, so it went to the kitchen and gobbled down some cookies. Now look at activity sheet two to find the cookies in the maze. The first missing color code needs to program Ozobot to move to the cookies. I will put my finger on start to follow the pathway to the cookies. Remember, you can turn your paper to check the direction your bot is moving. The first missing color code is a left at intersection. Do you see the left at intersection color codes in the color codes key? I will put in the color sequence green, black, red for the missing color code. The second missing color code has four colors. It must be a special move. Ozobot gobbled down the cookies. What special move in the color codes key could be used to show Ozobot gobbling down cookies? I'm thinking the spin code. I will put in the color sequence green, red, green, red for the second missing color code. Can you use your color code markers to put in the left at intersection color code for number one and the spin color code for number two? Are you ready to figure out the next missing color codes in the maze? Look back at activity sheet one. The second event says, after eating the cookies, Ozobot was thirsty. It got a refreshing drink of milk. Now look at activity sheet two to find the milk in the maze. The third missing color code needs to program Ozobot to move to the milk. I will put my finger on start to follow the pathway to the milk. Do you think Ozobot needs to turn right or turn left at the intersection to get to the milk? Ozobot will need to turn left to move to the milk. The third missing color code is left at intersection. I will put the color sequence green, black, red for the third missing color code. The fourth missing color code has two colors, so it must be a U-turn line end or a win exit. Since this is not the end of a maze, you will use the U-turn line end. I will put in the color sequence blue, red for the fourth missing code. Can you use your color code markers to put in the left at intersection color code for number three and the U-turn line end for number four? I wonder what Ozobot is going to do next. Look at activity sheet one. The third event says, then Ozobot heard its favorite song playing in the living room. It couldn't help but dance and started to backwalk. Look at activity sheet two to find the speaker in the maze. The fifth missing color code needs to program Ozobot to move to the speaker. I will put my finger on start to follow the pathway to the speaker. 
What direction does Ozvat need to move at the intersection to get to the speaker? Ozvat will need to go straight. The fifth missing color code is straight at intersection. I will put in the color sequence blue, black, red for the fifth missing color code. The sixth missing color code has four colors, so it must be a special move. Ozabot danced by doing a back walk. What special move in the color codes key do you think you will use? That's right, the back walk color code. I will put in the color sequence red, green, black, blue for the sixth missing color code. Can you use your color code markers to put in the straight at intersection color codes for number five and the back walk color code for number six? I'm having a lot of fun programming with you, but I think you can figure out the rest of the missing color codes on your own. You can check your work in the next chapter. Can you work on your own to figure out the other missing color codes? Read the next event, then find the missing color code to move Ozabot to the correct object. If you see four boxes, a special move color code is missing. You are a super programmer. Let's check your color codes and then see your bot in action. Color code seven is right at intersection. Color code eight is left at intersection. Color code nine is zigzag. Color code 10 is nitro boost. Color code 11 is a special move. Color code 12 is straight at intersection. And color code 13 is win, exit, play again. Now put your bot on start and watch it move through the maze following the sequence of events. Did you complete the skills check? Does your maze show all 13 missing color codes filled in? Does your work show how Ozabot moves through the maze following the correct sequence? Does your work show how the speed, special moves, and direction color codes can be used together? If you're looking for more to do, you can write your own sequence of events. Then use a blank map template to draw your own pictures and program your bot to show the events in order. Come back again soon for our next lesson.